Right, well, there are though two sides to a coin and of course two sides to a lens. After speaking to the Githeri man, Dan Mwangi spoke to the gentleman who says he took that picture as he was queuing for his mother who wasn't well, but just like him, was determined to vote. I woke up at around uh, 4 a.m., queued for about three to four hours. Finally, I was able to vote. Then afterwards, I went home, I was able to go I decided to go to my mom line because she didn't feel poor. So at that time, as I was still queuing on the line, I was to socialize with my, the rest of my friends, but those ones to Lipatauko. But suddenly, uh, a man came holding a polythene bag with a very half. So it was like all the everyone's concentration ilikuwa to that guy. Yeah. So due to the the, the happiness of the people in the queue. I decided to take a photo of that guy and uh, I sent it to my, one of my friends whom I met there. He came to me via the sender. At that time, I was not feeling very well. I to me because I was a bit worried because I was not feeling well or anything like that. Because no, see a visual post image of the person who so ni kamwa ni mtumie but the moment after after like some few hours after ni metoka kwa polling station and my mom voted ndo ni kamwa kuingia online nikaona one of my friends ame update ka whatsapp that's where nilishanga that's why nilishanga how comes na siku mtumia but the other guy nilimtumia so Akiliangu kawaza the the photo just started going viral. So at that time, sikuwa ni nataka kuambia mtu, but the moment niliona imex spread sana, I decided to share my my views na kushia sasa vile kulienda with my friends. Hmm. So how did you feel when you saw when the photo was, you know, was, was like the most popular photo on the internet in Kenya? Yeah, sasa tena hapo kwanza before nilikuwa nimefurahia but still na uoga kwa sababu my I started to tell my friend uh, that the photo is going viral. So due to the happiness she started convincing me in chat ni post via fb and instagram the the social media that i'm within but uh, due to that iyo woga ni kamua ni kwanza ni tulie but but mzuri ni kamua tu ni jitokeze mm. na before uko meogopa mako ka delete kwa simu why did you feel the need to delete it or <laughs> Then if you could delete because no not feature evidence. About credit, sijui unajua hiyo ni kwa raha zao. Because siku ya nime expect, in fact, eti itakuja kuwa viral. So, but for the ones who will wish, waneza ni sambaza, hata kiposti wadi, kila mahali. Hata kama ni world wide ni sawa. What do you do yourself? Uh, personally, I'm a form four liver last year. Yeah, but since last year I've been working in some places, Yakushikilia too. But for now I'm waiting to join university. Oh, yeah. What do you want to do in university? Uh, I want to do journalism. Ah. Yeah. So you're sort of in the line that you, your picture at a camera will put your scene will sort of in the line of what you want. Yeah. Which side of journalism are you interested in? In uh, recordings. This is a camera. Ian Kinudia, there, the photographer, the man behind that photo. So really, credit goes to him. Awesome he, picture. I know, and he said he just cleared from four last year, Ian Kinudia. So he's still really young. He's wondering what to do with his, his life. And he's created a picture.
that has captured the entire nation's imagination. So maybe um, he did some, maybe he might end up being a journalist. You never know right? a photojournalist because it's pictures like that that really do get people's attention. And I've got to say, um, the Githeri man, Martin, very smart guy for yes. actually carrying some food with him because we heard in many reports, whilst people were queuing, mm -hmm. waiting to mm -hmm. vote, mm -hmm. they were complaining of hunger and thirst because yes. they queued yes. for ages. All right, so those are just some of the fun bits um, that we've encountered during this 2017 election. But on to some other news. Uh,